What is up guys, thank you for stopping by and checking out another video. Today we're going to be talking about the US Key Vision Vlog Kit. Uh, this is their first take at a vlog kit. It is for uh, your mobile device uh, they have right here. It looks to be like an iPhone 11 Pro Max on the screen. You're in luck because I have that exact uh, phone. So we're going to go ahead and open this up. Nice packaging, opening it up right here in the back. Nice. Sweet. Okay, so first things first that I'm gonna notice about this is it comes in a extremely nice case. US Key Vision, great job, great innovation. Uh, this is a huge upgrade from the other items that you've carried. So I'm really impressed with this carrying case. Opening it up, here you go, you got your iPhone mount. This is a metal mount, so a uh, great job at that as well. You're also gonna, going to have a ball head, and the ball head goes right on top of the tripod. And then they have a shotgun mic. And guys, let me tell you, this is a heavy duty shotgun mic. Feels like it's mostly metal, so again, great job at innovating and progressing uh, down, your, down your products. Up top right here, uh, looks like we're gonna have a carrying case. Uh, looks like there's something in it. And yeah, so what you're gonna have right here is going to be your wires, your auxiliary wires for your uh, microphone, your shotgun mic. Uh, what else do we have here? We're gonna have a shock mount as well as a windscreen. So great job on that. You also have in a big Ziploc bag, you're gonna have a dead cat. Uh, me personally, I only like these whenever they're uh, really needed, so in windy situations. I don't like keeping it on the mic if uh, I'm not really going to need it. So let's go ahead and get into the setup of this uh, vlog kit. So again, we're going to start with the tripod. So first things first that you're going to want to do is you're going to want to get the ball head, and we're just going to screw this on. After we have it screwed on, you're gonna have a little knob. Make sure that that's loose and your ball up top will be able to move freely. So once that that's situated, uh, we're gonna have it straight up for now. We're gonna tighten down on it, that way it doesn't move. Uh, next thing you're gonna thread is your phone mount. And so again, metal mount, you're gonna take it. I'm gonna thread it on the bottom. If you wanted to, you could thread it in the middle and that way you can angle your uh, vlog kit like that. But I'm going to thread it uh, again on the bottom. Make sure it's nice and tight. Uh, after that, we're going to move into the uh, shock absorber or the shock mount for the uh, shotgun mic. Uh, we're going to loosen this up and then just slide it directly onto the... Uh, cold shoe mount on top of the phone mount. Okay, moving on. Uh, again, I have the 11 Pro Max. Take the case off. You can leave your case on it if you want to, but me personally, I'm just gonna take the case off. And then I'm going to slide directly into the mount. And so now it should look like this. Uh, you see everything's kind of mounted on. So now we're gonna move on into the shotgun mic. Again, you already put the shock absorber up there. And so now we're going to line it up and simply push the mic inside of the, uh, the mount. Looks just like that. So if you're using an iPhone, sadly most companies don't include the, uh, the lightning adapter. It's not their fault. It's really Apple's fault for uh, making it so complicated. Uh, but yeah, so you're gonna need the lightning adapter and then you'll use the cord that isn't uh, bungeed. So this one that's bungeed is gonna be for your camera uh, if you decide to use the shotgun mic with the camera. Uh, but if you're using it with a phone, then you're gonna use the cord that is straight. So once you have your lightning uh, adapter, you're going to plug that in, plug this in, and then you'll just simply plug it into the shotgun. And now you're set up, now you're ready to go. 
This is what it looks like whenever it's all said and done. Pretty nice stuff. Uh, great quality. Uh, again, most of the uh, the complaints that I had in my last US Key Vision video was uh, the fact that it was a little bit lower quality. Uh, but this right here, the mic is metal uh, or an aluminum. The, uh, the phone mount is a nice metal grade as well. Uh, so everything seems to be like it's built durable. Uh, the great thing about this is you can easily angle the tripod the way you want it and you're ready to go. I'm gonna switch over and give you some test footage right off of the camera. All right guys, so this is gonna be some test footage directly off of the iPhone 11 Pro Max front camera. Uh, I really don't recommend you using the front camera, especially with this uh, iPhone because you have that wide angle lens. Not only that, the front camera typically uh, dumbs down the quality. So switch to the back camera, the rear camera, whenever you're available to, and uh, that, that way you can get the, uh, the best quality out of your phone. Okay guys, so now we're gonna be on the wide angle lens, uh, and this is also on the rear camera, so you should have some better quality. I have uh, my camera or my phone right now recording in 4K at 24. Uh, I am using the stock uh, camera app, there's also uh, other versions of it. US Key Vision has their own version. Uh, Moment has a version as well as Filmic. Uh, all of those are great possibilities or great options whenever you're talking about using uh, a third party software or third party app in order to record some video. Let me know what you guys think about this, uh, this setup right here. Again, this is the US Key Vision vlog kit. This is gonna be K1. Uh, I believe that stands for their kit number one. It's going to come with a shotgun mic, the cords that you're going to need for that, the tripod, the tripod mount, as well as a ball head, and uh, you're ready to go. You're ready to to use this out on a, in the field, out on, the, on a go, or maybe just to record some behind the scenes. This is a great option, and with these phones only progressing in their cameras, uh, I really think this is a, a good option, uh, especially to record for me like behind the scenes and such like that. Thank you everyone for watching this video. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave it in the comment section down below. Uh, I'm going to leave a link to everything you're going to need down in the description. And as always, guys, I'm going to see you in the next one. Later.